borrow money from or you're lending him money or the person that you hire to work for you or anything you do, you know, giving nasiha, talking to somebody, making advice, reprimanding your son, teacher in school, whoever, whatever you do, doctors in the clinic and whatever. What do you need to do? An ad. Be fair. Be fair. Be fair not because it's a good business. Be fair not because it's profitable. Be fair it is not for your reputation. Be fair because Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has ordered you to be fair. Al Ad. Because also the scholar said you have to be fair because you when people talk to you or deal with you, you like for them to be fair with you. And that's why the Prophet said in the hadith reported by Muslim Imam Ahmad radiallahu anhu when he was giving advice, he said, وَأْتِ النَّاسَ بِمَا تُحِبُّ أَنْ يُؤْتَى بِهِ إِلَيْهِ وَأْتِ النَّاسَ بِمَا تُحِبُّ أَنْ يُؤْتَى بِهِ إِلَيْهِ You know, عَامِلِ النَّاسَ كَمَا تُحِبُّ أَنْ يُعَامِلُوا Deal with people in the way that you love them to deal with you. Okay? So, an adil, we are asking you to make adil, for you to make adil to people, and for people to make adil and be just also to you. So, but if you do not perform adil, you cannot ask people to be, to have, you know, adil or just to deal in a just way with you. Okay. You are you are the first. You know, you are the first. We cannot ask people to be fair and we're not fair. We have to be. Inna Allah. Inna Allah. Ya'mur bin Adam. And the scholar said, Al Imam ibn Ashur rahimahullah, and this the book of a tafsir, which is one of the best tafsir, you could put your hand on it right now. It's called At Tahriru wa Tanwiru Ibn Ashur. He died not too long ago. It is one of the best tafsir of the Quran. And it was, it's a collection of all the authentic understanding from the language and also from al athar from the narration that we have about the Quran. Al-Tahrir wa Tanwir Ibn Ashur. Ibn Ashur said, he said, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala in this ayah, he put the most important thing to be just, to be fair, okay? That's why he ordered number one in the line of Allah. Also the scholars say it is part of al adl part of being fair and just. Remember, if we step a little bit back, we said that fuqh and mu'amala deal with three categories, right? Mm -hmm. Category number one with Allah and with you, and with the people. In Allah ya'mur bil It is the biggest fear and the biggest just you can do is for you to have a proper aqidah. It is unfair to have partners with Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. It is unfair to have lillahi and dada, rivals. It is unfair for you to have rivals with Allah. It is unfair to put somebody equal with Allah. It is unfair. You see, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala told us in the beginning of the Quran, وَالَّذِينَ هُمْ بِرَبِّهِمْ يَعْدِلُونَ They make, they make e e equality. God forbid. You cannot have quarter. He cannot have equality. He cannot have andada. He cannot have rivals with him. Subhanahu wa ta'ala. Why? Because this is the highest rank of being fair. Inna Allah ya'mur bil He owns everything. He has everything. You know, lahu malakutu samawati wal arq. And then it is unfair for you to put partners. It's unfair to put somebody equal to him. So inna Allah ya'mur bil This word, it contains a lot of things. It contains the aqidah. Waiting and dealing with people, being fair with yourself, because that's what you're going to get back. So what is the difference between being fair 
and ihsan. Huh? A lot of the scholars said, Al-Adl is just to be fair. And ihsan for you to do an extra step. A lot of people gave so many examples, according to different scholars, they gave so many examples to that. And ihsan to do a little bit extra, being, being fair, but you could be fair and just fair. Right? You could be fair and a little bit more. Okay, here's a guy who works for you. At the end of the day, you have to pay him 100 bucks. Hey, here's your money, 100 bucks. Talk. You're fair. That's what we agreed on. Okay? And Ihsan, here's 100 bucks. Thank you very much. You have done a wonderful job. Appreciate it. This extra. This is part of an Ihsan. We call it Ihsan. Okay? The Ihsan is just doing extra. It can be done in the positive. It could be done in the negative. How could be done in the negative? Okay. Somebody made a mistake. Okay, I have this guy to do this work. He did the work, but it's not so perfect. At the end of the day, I come to him and I say, okay, you were supposed to do this and this and that. But you did it, but you're not very good. You have made some mistake, you know? So rather than give you 100, I'm gonna give you 90. Am I fair or not? I'm fair. But no ihsan. Okay? And ihsan to say, well, you didn't do it perfect, but I agreed with you on 100, and here's 100. So the extra 10 that you gave him, is that's part of the ihsan. To some extent. So this is what they call ihsan in the positive way, and Ihsan also in the negative way, okay? Somebody made a mistake, and then the judge told him, you know, the law gave me uh, a maximum <coughs> of to put you in prison for five years. But you were a good nature, you were this, you were that, you do not have previous criminal record, you do, 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 do. So I decided to listen to that, to make it three years. This is the negative way. Some of the scholars took that as that he did with him in a fair way, but also he gave him ihsan. Wallah subhanahu wa ta'ala, The scholar said this ihsan here is different than the ihsan that came in the hadith Jibreel alayhi salam. Al Islam wal iman wal ihsan and ta'bud Allah. This is too different. To the different issue, the same meaning, to the front understand. So we back to the ayah 90 of Surah Al Nahl. Inna Allah yamur bil adli wal ihsan. Al ihsan back to it, it has so many channels. As a matter of fact, some of the scholar um, they took that ihsan and they elaborate on it so much. Like for example, in the ayah of the Quran that I do not memorize, it is, وَإِذَا حَضَرَ الْقِسْمَةَ أُولُوا الْقُرْبَ وَالْيَتَامَ You know, فَعَاتُوهُمْ بِكَمْ So he said here, even though you were doing some kind of a division for money, for things, you know, and then some people outside, Legally, they do not have the rights of this money. Whether halal or kismet or qurba, you know, give him some. Even though, give him some. Okay? You're inviting somebody for dinner. We Most of the time we do that. He said, okay, only you and your wife. Okay? And let's say that there are poor people. What happened? Why don't you invite them, children? You know, it's not right. So they said, Ihsan. Ihsan is to do the extra, to walk the extra mile. Do whatever you can do, okay? Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, you know, will remember you. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will, 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 will grant that for you, will credit you for an Ihsan. Wa ita'i did qurba, ita'i did qurba, ita'i wa ita'i wa. The sentence is not, it's not clear. It's not clear to us, but it's clear to the scholar, it's clear to the people who they understand Arabic. Give your qurba the right way in everything. 
be good to them, it means be good to them. Give them love, <coughs> give them compassion, give them help, give them whatever you can. And then he said in the Qurba, who are the Qurba? Anybody who is the Qurba to you, anybody blood related, doesn't matter how far, okay? It is not in the Qurba only your parents, al Asad wal farah No. Some people say that the Qurba only my father and my parents and my brothers. No, it is not. It is, it is unknown. Some of the scholars say it is open. So everything in blood, everything in rada, including that. Ita in the qurba. Be good to them. Help them. They're poor, give them. They need help them. Whatever they want, lend them. You know, be good. Of course, according to your capacity. Back to the rule. Those rules that are all tied together at the end of the day. So, I have family that most of them are poor, and I'm okay. I'm, I only can give like $100. So, give that. But you're not responsible to give $200 because it is not in your ability. Okay? Or more. So, in Allah, I am one of the last one. It is the purpose of any benefit that you can do to <coughs> some other scholar. They said, It is the purpose. Listen to this, it's important, inshallah. Regardless of their action, okay? Regardless of their action. And we have two examples of this from the seerah. A guy came to the Prophet and said, Ya Rasulullah, I have a 